What's happening, my film nerds? David the Film Junkie here, and great news, Batman fans. Great, great news, okay? Uh, Bill Finger, okay? If you don't know who Bill Finger is, go ahead and wiki just Google him, uh, Wikipedia it. Um, he's finally going to get the credit he's deserved, deserved for the longest time. If you guys didn't know, this guy is a co-creator of Batman, okay? And a lot of people would say that he was more of the creator than Bob Kane, whose name is plastered everywhere. Anytime you see a Batman TV show, cartoon, uh, movie, you always see, uh, based on the DC Comics character created by Bob Kane. You, you never saw, did I say Bob Kane? God, Bob Kane! Sorry. No, I'm the Marvel mouth. Anyways, um, he just never got the recognition. Bill Finger had never seen re nothing. He never did. He created some of this stuff. He created... You know, just a lot of this, a lot of the Batman universe, but he never got the credit he deserved. But DC Entertainment finally announced that Bill Finger is going to get creation credit for anything from Batman versus Superman and on. So when we see Batman versus Superman, we see those opening credits. We're going to see Bill Finger's name right next to Bob Kane's name, I'm, I'm guessing. And it's great. And first thing down below, because uh, they, they released a, 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 a press release about this. So go read it, guys. I'm not going to read it right here because there's a lot that has to do with it. But it's just great news. Because I remember, you know, for the longest time, I've been a Batman fan, and I always thought it was strictly Bob Kane. I keep saying Bob Kane. Bob Kane. I keep seeing I kept seeing that, and I always thought it was just one man. But then I found out, I don't know, it was probably recent, probably like a few years ago, that he wasn't. And there was this other guy, Bill Finger, that was also a co-creator of Batman and created a lot in the universe, but never got the recognition. And it was like, I guess there was like, I don't know, there was just a lot of controversy about it. Not really like publicly, but it's just, it was kind of shitty. And it sucks because Fingers, he's been dead for a long time. So he doesn't get to see his name on the big screen. But whatever, it's okay. As long as he's getting the credit he deserves. Hey, rest in peace, Finger. You are awesome for creating such a great character. Let me know your thoughts about it down below. And like I said, first link down below if you want to go see their um, DC Entertainment and their little press release about it or a statement that they released. So, and they gave it to the Hollywood Reporter. So there you go, guys. Let me know your thoughts about it down below in the balls area. I'll talk to you later.